Hello everybody, Yelsa Farmer here and welcome to a new map tour. Oh yeah, we got some really big and flat fields there. This is uh, Backroads County by FSG, FSG Tasman Modding. <laughs> These are the same guys that made Chainsaw Valley and also have made a lot of other mods. Uh, this is a fictional uh, American Canadian map and yeah like you see um, yeah it's easy going farming on this one. Uh, the map and the equipment and all the cell points and productions are mostly um, in-game so to speak and these guys here <laughs> you got some really nice um, extra income in these two guys sir. We're going to come back to these guys. Uh, but anyway, um, I'm just going to jump into the map. Uh, this is the map. And yeah, I'm pretty sure it's a standard size map. And the download size on this map, it's only 73 megabytes. <sighs> The slot count is a little bit up there, but the the, the download size is like a John Deere 8RX. <laughs> so what do we start with? Well, we start with field 20 and 19, and we got the farm area and all the equipment there. There are also four other farms on this uh, map. You got one over here, which is together with field 2 and 3. Uh, that's the next level, you know, first you start here, and then you have the money, you can buy this for 440,000, or if you want to start really from scratch, uh, there's also a farm area down here, uh, which doesn't have any fields, but there's a, like a grass area around it, and we got a big farm up here, 1.2 million, together with these three fields, and the biggest one is the one down here, <laughs> 1.4 million. Uh, I really like the idea of having all the production facilities down here. Shoop. Uh, you got a bunch of cell points down here. Uh, the BGA is also down here. Uh, all of these production facilities are the same as you get um, on all maps, actually. There are no mods. As I could see, well, there is a mod when it comes to animals. And in this area here, and in this area here, there is like an open cow pasture. You have to buy it to, to see it. Uh, I haven't discovered any glitches uh, at all. The only thing, maybe, is that even on the farm I own, uh, we got sheep and cows. There's, you know, there's no trigger on it. Uh, it's not a big deal, so to speak. Uh, your start equipment is, yeah, it's up there. It's, uh, it's mid, mid to big, so to speak. And yes, there are collectibles. If I can get it, come on, buddy, get your fast ass up there. <laughs> you know, I didn't see this before, <laughs> but yet there are a hundred collectibles and it seems to be the uh, normal 1000 uh, toys. Uh, so here on the farm you have uh, 65 uh, sheep and the cows are 45 was it? Yeah, 45. Uh, let's see, let's jump into here and uh, get an overview. Uh, what what I also really like is that you can sell everything. So if I go into landscaping, demolish now, I can sell everything here, which is pretty handy. Uh, you got a bunker silo, manure heap extension, the animals, you got a farm silo, uh, you got a lot of equipment in here, uh, sleep trigger, you can also sell. And when you are buying these other farms, you will also get up um, uh, sleep triggers on all of these, actually. So that's actually a pretty neat feature uh, from FS19 to FS22, at least on console, that you can have uh, several sleep triggers. 
So what do we start with? Uh, what's the slot count? The slot count on New Farmer is 1193. Yeah, I know it's up there. Uh, but you know, as I said, you can sell all the equipment, all the sheds and animals. But you have some really nice um, start equipment there. Some medium tractors. You got a large case. Uh, uh, Mac super truck. The harvester is pretty big. It's fourteen thousand liter uh, harvester. Uh, a normal car. You got two trailers. Uh, big header. Plow cultivator. These are big boys. Uh, this one here requires three hundred and seventy-five horsepower. And the biggest tractor is three hundred and seventy-four. So it's on the edge. Uh, <laughs> it's there. Uh, contracts are available. Uh, there's no train. There is a forestry area, uh, as you can buy here. Uh, it's um, what should I say? It's a mixed forestry area. It's not only you know like pine trees. It's uh, you know what we can just jump in here and. Yeah, so you can see here, the forest area is a mixed uh, mixed thing between different kind of um, trees. And there we go, there's another collectible, uh, a nice area, this one. Uh, what else? Yeah, these guys here. You know what? First of all, I'm just going to jump in with a short clip on Farm Manager. There we go. So that's uh, farm manager. Uh, we didn't look into uh, when it comes to feed prices. Feed prices are pretty okay, actually. Uh, you know, if you want to extend your farm out to this, for example, it's like 160,000. These big boys here are like in three, four hundred thousand range. Um, you can also buy the road system. There we go, for 382000 And that also includes the shop. So this is the shop area. And I think maybe the slot count is a little bit high. Because of these guys here. You know, these doesn't look like decorations. These look uh, like real, um, you know, in-game equipment. You see, they are a little bit dig down to the ground but anyway and yeah no you cannot enter them oh you know what i didn't check the reset point let's say uh, let's take this one reset uh hopefully it's here oh yeah all right there we go that's the reset point um so you got to shop here the workshop trigger is around here there's also another workshop trigger uh, south on the map so what i think i'm gonna do and uh, let's see my notes here um yeah animals all the other farms five farms uh we're gonna jump in the car and we're gonna drive this way past this farm and down here i think just passing through all these production and yeah, maybe I'm going to cheat in some money and we're going to buy this one. And we're going to buy this one. Yeah. I think so. There we go. Oh yeah, the solar panels. <laughs> uh... You know, I, I never use solar panels because they're too expensive to buy. Uh, but these guys here, uh, let's see, now we have 100,000. Let's uh, fast forward 
Uh, one hour to nine o'clock. And they actually turn. At least they did turn. Oh, there we go. <laughs> uh, I, I did the fast forward uh, one day. And I got, what, 35,000? Yeah, 35,000. But that's on New Farmer. So you will also find these under generators i think it was yeah it's this guy here um but you know what if you don't like them you can boop, you can sell them for 40 46 000. Uh, yeah they're gonna that is a great uh, extra income of 35,000. So here we go, passing by our two fields, which you can easily, you know, plow together. And yeah, I like the landscape. It's flat. The roads are big, you know, even for me. <laughs> uh, there are no, um, there are no custom uh, crops on it. Uh, like I said, it's uh, basically just in-game equipment in-game sheds uh, I've looked on animals I've looked on vehicles and yeah I didn't find any mods even though also in the mod hub description it says that there are uh, two custom cow pastures uh, which we're gonna look at but this is the um, this is the farm uh, over at the northeast corner, which you can buy for 440,000, which contains uh, almost a cow's. Yeah. And once you buy uh, these farms, you know, you can uh, sell and demolish all the sheds if you want. But you see, you get a good picture of the. Uh, yeah, just over there we got the animal dealer and we also got some sell points for bales and animal dealer just there. So we're going to continue straight south. South. Let's see, what else did I write down? Um, yeah, forestry, yeah. There are no train system on this. As you can see, there are traffic. Uh, oh, I'm going a little bit too fast. Also, on the left side here, uh, there is a forestry area. But as you can see, uh, there are some good trees in between here. But also, there are these crooked, uh, non-logable trees. <laughs> just makes it a little bit uh, more um, you know interesting but I think it's uh, it's a great map for what should I say it's a great map for uh, new players on uh, FS22 that's for sure because here you get all uh, you, it's a really easy map to work on uh, it's uh, you. You got all the um, all the base game equipment and factories. Oh, there we go. So I'm just gonna jump in here now. And now we are at all the way on the south side, where we have all the productions, which are for time being before you buy them. Of course, they are sell points. Here's the BGA. This is the uh, this is the same one as this one, eight hundred seventy-five thousand. So you need to you need to pay that if you're gonna buy it and use it as a production facility. But for now, it's a sell point. Um, you know, it takes uh, the regular stuff: sugar beets, silage, potatoes, and those things. Um, yeah, so let's see. Uh, do, 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 do. But yeah, like I said, uh, I played on it for an hour or so, and I haven't discovered any 
any glitches, any bugs. So that's good. Good. Let's see. You know what? Well, you know what we're gonna do. Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna cheat in some money. The only mod I have installed is um, d -d 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 this one, the government subsidy sign. And I'm gonna place down a couple of these, and so then we can buy some of the other farms. <laughs> So, we suddenly got uh, nearly 9 million on our account, and where am I? Well, I'm all the way down here now, uh, where you also have workshop trigger and a fuel station. Uh, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to jump over here, boop, and this is what got my attention. Uh, this area here, which, you know, it's a grey area on the map, uh, but it's fenced in. And if you see here, there are some, you know, food troughs. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to buy it together with Field 9. It's cheap as chips, actually, 126,000. And it doesn't show up anything here, uh, no animal triggers. But if you jump over here, then you suddenly got some triggers. And this will hold 250 cows. So this is a custom one. But the thing is, this is not... You don't find this under animals. Uh, so next thing I'm going to test now, can I demolish this? Yeah, cow pasture you can demolish for 37,000. Um, but you don't find it here. I thought maybe it was this one, uh, but it's not. This is holding 15 cows, and this one will hold 250. So you know what? I'm going to buy myself uh, one cow. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm just going to see if it's uh, custom food uh, options. Uh, nope, seems to be normal. You actually have to give them water and TMR is always the best one so yeah they need water and this is the um what should i say this is the farm area where um which is the cheapest one actually uh also here sleep trigger you got some sheds a silo and you got some grass area here which is actually it's not painted grass uh, I think this is... You know what? Let's buy it. Because if I go into here and I choose grass, you can see... You know what? I'm going to buy it. And let's see if I get something up here. No, no field info. So there's no field number on it either. So I don't think you can like hire a worker on it. Uh, but it definitely looks like grass. <laughs> Oop. So, we're going to continue, and on the right side here, we also have uh, some more cell points. And the gas station where we just were. Also, this is in-game... Um, what should I say? Cell points. This is the what is it? Johnson and Johnson. <laughs> Johnson Farmers Market. You got a lime buying station, a feed and grain south, and a debris crusher. I've looked on prices. It seems to be normal prices on more or less everything. And when you see the storage here is zero liter, that means that this is what you can put in your silo. So the silo you have is, uh, it's not a multi-fruit, uh, and yeah, nothing special about it. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to jump in the car, and we're going to drive up to this farm. Yeah.
There we go. I missed the exit. Uh, whoa, 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 whoa. So this is the uh, this is the big boy. This is the uh, biggest farm area. And also here there is a custom made uh, open cow pasture. Uh, do I have the money to buy it? Uh, yeah, let's buy it. Um, and another thing, um, it's not a glitch, but this one now, you know, I cannot sell because I have placeable on it. Uh, but this farm up here, if I buy this one, I also have placeables on this one, old sheds and farmhouse. This one, strangely enough, I can sell. <laughs> And I think it's the same with these guys. Yeah. And if I want to sell it back, I have placeable on it. So, yeah, um, it's a little bit strange one. Um, also here, not a glitch. Uh, just something to uh, look at, maybe. FSG. Uh, there are two triggers of everything here. And uh, I tried on different angles. Maybe there were, you know, like two animal triggers there uh, but this will hold 150 cows let's see let's buy one of these guys and let's see if this one demands anything special um, no same here same here with food and you also need to give them water uh, food uh, they demand straw no Ah, okay. So, no straw means um, uh, you're not going to make any manure, actually. But I think that's the case with the in-game one on your start farm. You know what? Now I'm getting curious here. Uh, <laughs> uh, let's go here. Yeah, of course, you have a manure heap extension on your farm so your your uh, cows will make manure uh, because these guys you can also give uh, straw uh, but not these guys but yeah so this is the uh, big boy big boy farm also here same sleep trigger you got a big fat silo and also an extension uh, but I like the farm area it's flat it's open, you can place down more sheds, sir. And like I said, no, not that one. Uh, you know, if you don't like this silo here, this is an extension, this is an extension, and this is the main, you know, you can sell everything here. And go crazy and place down, uh, oh. <laughs> All right, how in the world am I gonna get that one? That's a, that's a collectible. <laughs> and we got some collectibles here. There we go. Oh, they are 5,000. Oh, Uchi Mama, all of these 5,000? Ah, okay. So the collectibles are also uh, custom. Because usually these are. These guys here <laughs> are a thousand. But anywho, now we know. <laughs> there we go. So, where are we? Where are we? So, we went from our farm. We went into this farm. We had a brief look at the animal dealer. We went down here. Uh, we didn't look at the uh, sawmill. Uh, but also the sawmill is a pretty straightforward one uh, where you can sell your logs boop, on this trigger and if you want to buy the production it's gonna cost you a hundred thousand and also these you know this these also are maybe are stealing some slot counts I don't know and yeah you can go into productions and this is also you know like a forestry area, but it's um, you got some crooked trees in between there. So yeah, oh, another one. Let's see how much we get from this. 
Yeah. <laughs> and we looked at the cell point cell, the small form, and now we are at the big form. And yeah, I'm just going to drive up to this one. I'm going to buy it. And I think that's the last thing on my whoa, on my notes. Uh, it also says in the um, mod hub that it is position farming ready, so to speak. Uh, that just basically means that the map maker has uh, put down his own. Yeah, what should I say? Soil map. Uh, I think if they don't do it, uh, Giants is just gonna put down a random, you know, soil map for it. Uh, but if we we also got another map today. Uh, what's it up here? Let's see. Yeah, uh, Felsbrunn. Uh, Felsbrunn, uh, 22. I think I might have to jump into that tomorrow and have a look at it. Felsbrunn, uh, was the first map I played on, uh, whenever I started FS19. A little bit on Ravenport and a little bit on Felsbrunn. So, I'm, yeah, I'm really excited. I'm gonna download it. And see if there are, you know, any big changes from FS19. So this is the um, second largest um, uh, farm. Uh, we also got cows. This is the, uh, I think that's the big boy. Let's see, cows. Uh, I think it's this one. Yeah, with 80. Yeah, this is the one with the robot, feeding robot. Yeah, so it's that one with 80. And yeah. Uh, let's see, and yeah, we've been to the shop. Uh, so I think we've been all over the place. Um, it's a nice map. It's, uh, as, it's a basic map. There we go. A basic map. A uh, basic map with basic equipment, with a couple of uh, custom-made uh, uh, open cow pastures. Uh, if you buy them, don't demolish them, because uh, they are not in the mod hub, so to speak, for you to buy back. So you just have to be a little bit careful with that. But I think that was it for my first look uh, and a short map tour on back roads county by fsg modding thanks for watching and i hope i see you the next time and we are back home oh there we go that's my money machine <laughs> anywho uh again thanks for watching and i'll see you the next time bye bye